Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I'm Rachel, in case if you are new, I'd love it if you would join the family. And I just wanted to say a welcome to my new subscribers. And if you have channels, just um, if you would leave the name down below in the comments so I can check them out. Today's video is going to be kind of like a huge Dollar Tree haul. I went to two different stores and I just got a bunch of little random stuff. I have it all in this uh, really big tote because I was going to try and film upstairs. And so let's, let's just get started. Um, I thought for little stocking stuffers that these would be good. So I got one for each of my kiddos. This is in no particular order. Like I said, it's all just crammed in a tote. Um, I found these cute little tumbler glasses. I have another one, but it's upstairs. I already drank out of it. But this one has Be Strong, Trust Yourself, Be Your Own Hero, You Do You Girl, Be You, Different Is Beautiful. Um, super cute. I like to buy these all the time and uh, just throw them away after a couple months. Because a lot of times I notice that the Dollar Tree ones, like, they kind of like grow mold, like right there where it screws in. And like you can take this rubber piece out, but it's still kind of hard to get get it cleaned in between where like the cup screws in together. So I usually just toss them out and buy new ones like every couple months. I, if you guys remember in my last Dollar Tree haul, I bought um, feminine wipes because I thought they were face wipes. These were the face wipes that I thought they were. Um, I got, I think, three packs of these. I wanted to make a little goodie basket for a friend, so I got three packs of those. I'm sure they're good. I don't like, some Dollar Tree wipes are pretty good, but I don't like other ones. Oh, these are the black ones, I forgot. So they're black wipes. Oh yeah, these are good. Oh, most definitely. Those are good. Those aren't normal. Dollar Tree wipes. Oh, and they smell good too. And um, I love the Dollar Tree matches. They are by far the best matches ever. They are good. They are sturdy and they're just good. They have to be the kind that has the green though. I don't like the other ones. And I'm sure I don't need this many. But I also found some more of those unicorn brushes. Um, I got three of these smaller ones and I think three of these bigger ones. I am going to purchase, uh, I have like one of those bralettes one. There's like no padding, no underwire or anything. So I got it like strapped pretty tight and the shirt just doesn't go well with it. Anyway, for Christmas, my husband and I usually just we buy our own gifts, but they're from each other, so we get what we want, and most of the time they're usually more expensive gifts, but I want to get a new makeup desk, so I want to display some cute brushes, and these are super cute. I like how they go from like the um, purple to the blue, back to the purple, so I really like those, so I've just been collecting these so I can make like a cute little display. Um, I would like to do like get ready's with me and stuff, but I don't like lugging all my makeup down here that I like like to use. So hopefully, whenever I get my new makeup vanity, I can get like a new like I don't know if they make them or not. If not, I'll make my own. But I want to get like a little mini ring light so I can like put on my makeup vanity and be able to have extra light and my desk be big enough where it can hold my camera and everything and me film. I don't know. So, I just... Um, another thing I was super excited about, because my daughter got one of those little Fiji, is it 8 millimeter? I don't know, the little Polaroid looking things. Um, she got one of those for her birthday. So, um, Dollar Tree had these. They had the little black clips. So, I got two of those. And I found the little colorful ones. She likes these, so I got two boxes of those. And we're going to make like a little DIY um, little thing to hang all of her Polaroid 
I don't know, they're not called Polaroids, but those little mini things, the little mini pictures. I also found a Lisa Frank calendar. Um, my daughter likes to have a calendar in her room, even though she doesn't keep up with it. She just thinks they're cute. So I got one of these. They had Care Bears. Um, they had a bunch of really, like, cute ones that, like, were all, like, 90s stuff. So, super cute. I also got another one of these. This one is, I, I think this one's different than the other one that I got. But I also found these Jot pencils, coloring pencils. So, I thought, um... My younger sister likes to paint and do stuff like that, so I thought I would gift her one of those. I also found these new cute little um, hair bands. I got these for my daughter um, to pull her hair back so, you know, we don't get no bugs or anything while she goes to school, and I just thought they were cute. Um, she doesn't like real big bows. Um, she always takes them out, but I figured if it was something like this... It might not bother her as much. And another stocking stuffer. I found this cute little donut zipper bag. Just something cute and small. Um, I'm going to try and show you guys everything I can in the 15 minutes that it allows me now. Um, and what I don't get to show you, um, I'll just do a part two. Because I do have quite a few things. I noticed that they had a bunch of like the little surprise bags. They had different ones. Um, but I just got four of these for my daughter. They're the little crystal animals. Um, stocking stuffers. It's, it's junk really, but it's the surprise of opening stuff. And you guys, I do have another wish haul coming. I did, um like body jewelry. I am researching like electronics because I want to see about like their lighting and just anything to kind of like help somebody out with YouTube to see um, what's the best. So I might just do like a whole video of different kind of lighting that they have and then let you know like out of the five which one is actually worth the money. I found some more of these a big um, dry erase markers. These are in color though. These are amazing guys. Love these. I also found um, I got some more of these. Um, I want to do a DIY with these but I'm not real for sure but I got a couple packs of those. I found this 250 mind game puzzles but it's got like a bunch of different stuff in there. It's got Sudoku. It's got um I don't know what arrow word and then it's got like dominoes it's got word search it's got crisscross it's um, just a bunch of different stuff but my mom likes stuff like this so I thought I would make her like a little just a little gift things of some of the little goodies that she likes um, I found this poo do <laughs> Um, it's just squishy, gooey slime. And I also found this. I'm going to put this in the freezer so it will be good on Christmas. But it's a little Tonka truck chocolate bar that is in the shape of a dozer. My son loves heavy equipment. So I just thought that was super cute. And they had different ones, but I got him the... I don't know if it's a dozer or backhoe. It's something, but I got him that. I also got another one of these. You guys, I'm telling you, this is in the baby section. Use this to um, remove your fingernail polish. It is so much better than any paper towel, cotton ball. It's This is so much better. You'll get use after use of this, and then once like there's no space on it, you just toss it out. And then I also found these cute little socks. I don't know if you guys, they're so different. They're like knitted, I guess. I don't, but they're super soft and I love these. They had a couple different colors of those. 
I also found the temporary hair collar. Um, I usually just use Arctic Fox, and I let my daughter use Arctic Fox because it's non-toxic and everything, and it's made with conditioner. But she's seen this and wanted it, so I thought we'd give it a try. I highly doubt that it'll work on her brown hair, though. And then I also found this really cute dish towel. Like I said, I just use these for looks, but it says home is where the heart is. And it's just just super cute. I like to buy cheap dish towels just for like decor um, to hang off like the rail, the little rail on my stove. And then once they just get kind of old looking, I toss them. I also found some canvases. I think I got some last time, but I want to say these are a different size or a different thickness maybe. Um, I got some of this paint. My son goes through this like crazy, so um, this is, I actually bought two. The other one I already opened, and they were all really good. There was one that was a little bit dry, but once you stirred it up, it was still creamy, but you could still paint with it, so it was pretty good. I also found this Himalayan salt um, soap by Dial. Smells amazing. It is good. I also bought a ton more face masks. These are really cool because these are, it says DIY powder to clay mask. It comes with this little tray and then you mix your mud together and then you put it on your face. So I got a couple of those for some goodies for other people. And this is the sleeping mask. Um, I believe it just goes like under your eye. It might be a whole mask, but I want to say... It's only in small portions. And then they also had the vitamin C boosting and brightening one. That one's for hydrating. And it's that. So it's not like a normal sheet mask. And I'm this one says yes to cotton protects and minimizes irritation for ultra sensitive and allergy prone skin. It's a little mud mask and there's mud in there. So it's not actually a face mask. These for a dollar is a great deal, you guys. I literally stocked up this time and last time. I also, <laughs> my car was low on antifreeze. So when I went to Dollar Tree the second time, I like froze to death. So the other stuff's out in my car, but I bought a couple pairs of gloves, another toboggan, and a scarf because I was freezing. But I got this little headband. I love wearing stuff like this. And I just thought like the little silver gems were cute. And I'm a sucker for the pale pink. So I got that as well. I also got some of these pine cones that smell like cinnamon. I'm going to kind of rush because a lot of this is not very new. This is new though. It is a stencil brush. And I got this because I... I have some stencils and I'm not very good at doing stencils or freehand for that fact but I thought maybe I just want to see if it's good it feels a little um, coarse but I don't know what it's supposed to feel like so oh and I wasn't gonna get these I got the white ones because they match with with my um, Christmas tree but I had to get the rose gold angel wings I wanted these so bad last year and my store never got them, but they got them this year. I'm just going to make it work. I absolutely love these. They are, I like them better than the white ones that I got. I like, I love those. I also got some more picks, but they are the same as last year. I got two with the apple and pine cone. I got two of the white ones with the pine cones. I'm going to make something with it or just shove them in my tree. I'm not for sure. I got two of the these kind and two of oh, two of those, but the leaf fell off of this one. <laughs> I also found these and I stuck little tea lights in them already. I just, they're kind of cute and simple. And I can put um, below my living room TV because there's only like that much space in between how it's hung and that. And I also found this little tea light candle. It's a little reindeer, super cute. And my favorite out of everything was this. I bought four of these. 
they are like a little um, picture clip thing, and I absolutely love it. All right, you guys, that is everything for my Dollar Tree haul. Hope you enjoy. Give it a thumbs up, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.